Hello everyone and welcome to my Bachelorette official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Lone Wolf in Heaven couple Noah Erb and Abigail Herringer are hitched. They secured the bunch in a dazzling open-air function encompassed by companions, family, and a few Lone Wolf country stars. Continue to parries for every one of the subplities. Noah Erb and Abigail Herringer's relationship had a sensational beginning. They met on season 7 of Single Man in Heaven separated before the season final and afterward reunited. They've been together from that point forward lastly got connected last summer. The most recent couple of months have been a great deal of the youthful couple. They've been arranging their wedding, redesigning the home they purchased in Oklahoma, and going out on a little book visit for Abigail's diary she distributed a month ago. In this way, when it came time to seal the deal, the couple kept it relaxed, contrasted with other single-man country wedding. Abigail skirted a lone wolfish end of the week. All things being equal, the couple arranged a few days of pre-wedding exercises for their family members and companions rolling in from a out of town. Abigail Herringer and Noah Erb at last wedded following a few days of fun on Monday, October 7. They picked Noah's old neighborhood. Tulsa, Oklahoma, for the wedding. Abigail cleared up for Individuals magazine that the city likewise has an individual significance for them. From secret date evenings when we were sequestered from everything during Single Guy in Heaven to now settling in our new home, Tulsa has forever been so extraordinary to us, she said about the city where they purchased a home and right now live. The outside wedding occurred at the Philbrook Historical Center of Craftsmanship. The garden party topic for the wedding was enlivened by the incomparable Gatsby. In spite of the magnificence motivation, the pre-marriage ceremony were shockingly private. There were just 90 or so visitors, yet a few single-man country alums earned welcomes to the select wedding. As indicated by individuals, Joe Mabel and Serena Pitt, Chelsea Vaughn, Serena Bite, Evan Lobby, Thomas Jacobs and Becca Kufrin, Chris Bukowski and Anna Redman, Demur Jackson, Blake Moynes and Zach Clark went to the wedding. There's no word on the off chance that Caitlin Bristow was supposed sweetheart Zach Clark's in addition to one. Abigail Herringer led fans in on her wedding dress shopping experience a couple of months prior. Be that as it may, she kept her last dress pick to herself until the eagerly awaited day. As indicated by individuals, she picked a Netta Ben Shabu's jade strapeless dress, which highlighted a darling neck area and ethereal, Grecian-propelled hanging subplities. Noah's more seasoned sibling, Ben, administered the pre-marriage ceremony. His twin sibling, Aaron Erb, was his best man. Abigail's sister filled in as her housekeeper of honor. Maki, the German shepherd the couple took on, was additionally important for the wedding. The power source detailed that the couple's most memorable dance was to the Miley Cyrus melody, Love You. Noah Erb uncovered that they at first intended to visit Asia for their special night. In any case, they changed plans for an all the more relaxed escape. They intend to spend their vacation in Jackson Opening, Wyoming. After their vacation, they intend to begin a family yet need to appreciate life as a wedded couple first. At the point when you're a well-known person, all that you do gets intensely examined. Lone Ranger Country's Claire Crawley has never been one to avoid expressing her genuine thoughts. At the point when a new virtual entertainment analyst came for her nurturing abilities, the cherished star of season 16 of the unhitched female rushed to fire back with a strong reaction. Continue to Perry's firing on the strained association. Four shows Claire inside Crawley the Lone window. Ranger establishment to track down adoration. She showed up on Lone Ranger in heaven two times, alongside single man winter games. Fans originally became hopelessly enamored with her when she was a competitor on Juan Pablo's time of the unhitched male. 
She broadly berated him after he unloaded her in the final. Claire happened to find love with Dale Greenery on the single woman momentarily. In any case, it was only after she was finished with the establishment that she tracked down affection. She opened up to the world about her sentiment with mascot sports chief Ryan Dawkins in 2022. They invited their little girl, Rowan Lilly, in January 2024. The couple wedded in 2023. Claire just stunned everybody by conceding that the 2023 marriage wasn't lawful. Click here for every one of the subtleties on her genuine wedding to her child daddy. Claire Crawley longed for being a mother for what seems like forever. Her fantasy at law last worked out before this year by means of surrogacy. A savage left a dreadful remark on the Lone Wolf Country star's sweet birthday recognition for Ryan Dawkins. According to the skeptic, they remained at a similar inn as Claire and Little Family. The virtual entertainment analyst asserted that Claire and her significant other were on their telephones the whole time and disregarding their young little girl. Claire didn't take analysis of her nurturing quite well. She reposted the remark on her IG story with a curt applaud back. Claire Crawley composed that she and her significant other are d asterisk men great guardians. She called the individual out for likewise being on their telephone to record such a scornful bit of feedback. The Lone Ranger country star said there were many reasons she might have been on her telephone. Perhaps she was minding her mother, who has dementia. Or on the other hand, she might have been making arrangements or in any event, working. She called attention to that the individual had no clue about why she was on her telephone and it was not their concern at any rate. She circled back to another post calling the individual a stalker. The trade among Claire and the savage was posted on Reddit, and most of remarks were on the previous unhitched female star's side. Bravo, Claire. As the individual is leaving this remark, on her telephone, how about you separate and beat available? I think Claire is one of the mindful ladies out there. She talks her reality and gets down on the Bologna stuff. Ha! Huh. I sincerely don't get individuals that vibe the need to remark stuff like this or more awful on individuals' web-based entertainment. She saw her all all end of the week, however, didn't have the daringness to stroll up and confront Claire directly to put her telephone down. What a comedian! Individuals are so abnormal. I would never be somebody sufficiently renowned to be perceived and open, since you can do nothing without some console fighter remarking as though they know your life. Teaching about how telephones ruin human connection by means of public remark on Powerhouse's profile. Moon seems okay. Totally off the wall remark from the savage, and I'm happy the answered it. Do you suppose the remark about Claire's nurturing was off the mark? Sound off in the remarks. Noah's more seasoned sibling then administered the pre-marriage ceremony. His twin sibling, Aaron Herb, was his best man. Abigail's sister filled in as her housekeeper of honor. Maki, the German shepherd the couple took on, was additionally important for the wedding. The power source detailed that the couple's most memorable dance was to the Miley Cyrus melody, Love You. Noah Herb uncovered that they had first intended to visit Asia for their special night. In any case, they changed plans for an all the more relaxed escape. They intend to spend their vacation in Jackson Opening, Wyoming. After their vacation, they intend to begin a family yet need to appreciate life as a wedded couple first. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.